Hi guys, this is just a, a video on how to use Google Drawings to annotate an image. So what we'll do is, Google Drawings is one of the applications in Google Drive. So we'll just get started straight away. First of all, I'm going up to the New button and going to select New Google Drawings. If you haven't got Google Drawings, you can find it, download it as an app and make it available on your Google Drive. But here we go. Google Drawings should open up a new sheet to work on. And here it is. So the objective here is to get an image from your computer, put it on here, and then annotate it. And so I'm going to give the simplest way of doing that. First of all, you'll see up the top here, there's lots of options which you should explore. But here, let's get an image from my computer. And I have, in this case, I have a picture of a human heart. So if you're in a science class and you want the kids to annotate an image of a heart, only downloaded. So it can take a little while to download sometimes, depending on the size of the image. So here we go. Now what's happening is the image is being placed into the Google Drawings. And what I want to do is resize. Obviously, I probably don't want the image to take up the whole screen. So I'm just going to bring that down and put it in the middle. You'll see a red line appear when it's in the middle. But that's really perfectly in the middle. Those red lines appear. OK, so there we go. The image is now placed in the middle. And this is an open source image. So uh, don't worry about copyright because it's been sorted. Now annotations, let's go up here to shapes and arrows. So if we want an arrow that points to the right, we'll click on that and we can make an arrow that points to the right. Not only that, but we can easily put text inside the arrow. And we can easily change the color. We'll change that one to red. And we'll move it around to where we like. We might have the red one pointing towards the blue. And then we'll go up and get another one. And this is an arrow pointing to the left. And I'll build one over here. About that size again. And point it towards where you want it. And more text. You can also, we won't change the color of this one. You can turn it around and have it go like on an angle if you need to point it at something exactly. So here's an example. And you'll find that there's more options up here. You can change the line, you can change the background, this checkered color can be changed. Obviously we have text boxes and shapes as you can see there are there are equations you can put in. Call outs which is another range of shapes which can do a variety of things. Uh, different types of arrows as you can see and a whole range of shapes that might be a little bit more interesting. So be creative with it but here's the basics of it. You can annotate an image and share it with your friends or keep it permanently. So there you go. That's how to use Google Drawings from Google Drive to annotate an image. See you next time.